Yo, what is up guys? It's Marsville. Welcome back to the channel and ooh, -hoo -hoo, we got something nice today. So let's go ahead and get started. Oh man guys, this is the first time I actually ever saw this knife. Um, it was actually from another YouTuber. I thought it was just one of the coolest knives ever. Like I was in it and it even comes in this tin. I was like, what? But never did I think that I would actually own this knife. And here it is a couple months later, I got one. I don't know guys, what can I say? <laughs> but I'm gonna show you guys now. So let's go ahead and remove this, boom. And guys, you got your knife. Your little, uh, here I'm gonna open this up for you real quick. You just get your nice, sick ass uh, DC cleaning cloth and then some uh, some cards that I'm gonna pull out for you guys. I just put this away, honestly, when I first, first got it. I just like, I'm gonna keep all this, all this really nice and pretty, you know, for later. So we got this nice little card, Dante Concept. Very nice, very clean. And then we got the certificate. Shee -shee! So, uh, yada, yada, yada. I'm gonna get to this stuff later. Sanfei Temp Symphony Tonto, CPM S30, Tai Dobruski uh, 10 of 13. Um, I kind of skim the specs because I'll uh, I'll get to them. I'll get to them. Just wanted to show you guys that real quick. Um, but I just put that aside. I'll fix it up later. The knife. Oh my God. He actually let me put the color of the sleeve too, which I thought was cool. I like this color. I was like, yo, give me that one, bro. And oh my God. Uh, yo, this guy is, oh my God. I can't stop looking at it sometimes. Look at this thing. Oh, so mean. Oh, so clean. Guys, should, should we open it real quick? Let me get this thing out of the way real quick. Let me show you guys. I did take off the latch, but I did take a couple of clips. We'll be showing how this works. Really cool latch, um, but I did take it off for balance uh, issues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real quick opening, guys, because I just love the blade. Oh, so much. Oh my God. God, yo, check out that. If you guys know me, I love me some Tonto. And this thing screams Tonto. It's the American Tonto style. That's what he uh, calls it. Very, very nice. Oh, my God. I just love it. Whew. But anyways, guys, let's just get right into the specs already. Um, but before that, guys, remember about the sound test at the end of the videos. If you want to hear what it sounds like. But anyways, let's get to those specs. All right, guys, so we are looking at a handle length of 5.5 inches long, a handle thickness of half an inch, blade length of 4.97 inches long, and a blade thickness of 0.15, and we are looking at an overall length of 9.78 inches long. And guys, I have been digging this length it's like right under 10 inches it is oh my god so much ever since i got this knife i've just love love the handling on it so 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 much but it's just my preference guys everyone has their own you know ideas um so we are looking at a handle material of titanium along with the latch and the pivot and screw with the latch all titanium so high quality materials there uh very sick i kind of like that touch we are looking at some bronze anodized accents and um, he actually did a few colors from blue, purple, green and I happen to get the bronze accents. Um, they're actually kind of fading out already. You can see it towards the bottom. They're fading out a little bit and I don't flip this knife a whole, whole lot, um, but I do flip it for a bit when I do. Uh, so anyways, moving on, we are looking at some channel titanium handles, guys, if you haven't already seen that. Um, so I love me my channel titanium. So blade material, we are looking at some CPM S30V. Woo! That high quality bougie stuff. I like it. With an American Tonto blade style. Oh, I had to get me the Tonto. He's got skimmies. I think he's doing buoys next. Um, he's doing quite a few blade styles and they all look very nice. I'm not even gonna lie, but 
This Tonto was screaming my name. I had to. And guys, I don't have a whole lot of knives with this touch, but we are looking at a hollow grind. Oh my God, guys, I love me a hollow grind. So clean. I love that. I love the grind on this thing so much. Along with a satin finish, almost like a mirror finish on this thing. But yeah, we got a satin finish on the blade. Very nice touch. So guys, the weight, we are actually looking at 4.6 ounces. Um, with the latch, it is 4.7, so I did take that off. It was a little imbalanced. I could feel it right away. Um, with a nice neutral feel. Oh, God, guys, I cannot tell you. I just love, I mean, it is my preference. I love these elongated holes on the handles. They just, ooh, woo, flips like a bounce. So guys, we are looking at a DC latch system. And uh, guys, I'll put a clip real quick uh, on the screen. Um, this thing is actually one of the coolest latches I've ever seen. I just thought, God dang, Dante, cool. Always trying to, trying to stand out. But again, it does throw off the balance, so I had to take it off. I'm sorry, but very, very cool touch. You kind of squeeze the handles and boo. Um, so guys, I don't know why, but I had the for the longest time, I was under the uh, impression that this thing was running on bearings. No, we got some bushings on this thing, uh, along with some phosphorus bronze washers. Um, the bushings are a bit undersized, but really, it's no big deal. Um, it's like I had to loosen one of the pivots, the pivots by a hair, and now it's uh, just fine. Swings just, just, just fine. I love this thing. I love this thing so much. Um, and we are looking at some tank pins on this one, guys. Ooh, not too crazy on tank pins, but I don't care. All right, let's do that sound test or tap test. Nothing on that one. And good on both sides. Let's check out that play. Pretty much no play, guys. Love this thing. So guys, a little bit about Dante Concept, if you uh, guys don't really know who he is, he is actually Dobruski Knives, and uh, Dobruski Knives has been making knives since 1992. This guy is a knife maker who's just been, I mean, like, he makes some of the most high-end, premium, beautifully made bala songs I've seen, like, wow, and along with these bala songs, he makes some beautiful, beautiful folders, like, this guy makes all kinds of stuff, it's really, really nice, high-quality stuff, he knows what he's, he, you can say he knows what he's doing, he knows what he's doing, and the Dante Symphony is actually just a lineup of bala songs that he makes, and um, the more flipper-friendly bala songs, I guess you can say, and guys, Guys, ever since I've had this knife, it's just been such, such a pleasure to flip. I've everything about the handles is just all me. Like I love the square but rounded. It's got nice flats on the sides, very, very rounded edges. So I, I'm, I kind of like rounded handles a little bit. But it's not exactly rounded. Like it's still square. And then you got the jimping on both sides. A very nice touch. And I've, I, I'm a, I'm a big fan of these slots. I don't know why. I just. I love these slots so much. And you got these little holes up here and stuff. But guys, oh my gosh, this thing is just such an amazing piece. He only made 13 of the Tontos. I believe he only makes 13 of each uh, blade style. And I got number 10 on this bad boy. So very, very nice touch. I'm so happy I can own this. This thing is so, so sick. So, so sick. So yeah, guys, that's uh, pretty much gonna sum up today's video. Uh, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, like the video if you guys liked it, subscribe if you guys haven't already. Um, comment down below if there's uh, something you like about this knife or if there's something I missed that you guys know about. Let me know, um, but uh, that's pretty much it, guys, and I hope you guys have an awesome day. Peace.